with concussions again making the headlines in the NFL. Local doctors are making sure to keep athletes safe from concussions here. WLWT News 5's Adam Burnison joins us in studio now. Uh, with You spoke with the doctor, Adam, and mm -hmm. what do you have to say about recent par about parents and what they should do with their children? Yeah, obviously very important, especially with the recent NFL news. Sheree and Ashley, I spoke with Dr. John Devine, who is a physician and concussion specialist for the UC football team. He says while he hasn't necessarily seen an increase or decrease in concussions over the years, the growing awareness has helped people catch signs and treat a concussion better than ever before. We do know statistically that once you've had one, you're more likely to have another. And if you've had two, you're much more likely to have a third. Whether it's through contact sports or simply hitting one's head, concussion levels can vary and the symptoms can vary from person to person as well. Typical symptoms to look out for are confusion, headaches, vision changes, dizziness, and nausea. According to Dr. John Devine, a physician for the UC football team, it's crucial to catch concussions early. Don't miss the first one because the second one, if it happens while the first one's still in effect, it's going to take longer to get better. In the past, recovery was about resting in a quiet and dark room. Dr. Devine says while rest is important in the first 12 to 24 hours, what they know now about concussions have given them more insight on better recovery for patients. We want people to be active, engaged, and try to do things at a lower intensity level that doesn't provoke symptoms. We know that people that do that get better quicker. Now with the UC football team, Dr. Devine and his team have also worked with players on vision training. He says this has further helped them detect and improve recovery from concussions. Adam Burdison, WLWT News 5.